Hello friends, welcome to another lecture of Make Mechanical Simple. See, in the we discuss about fluid machinery in Module 6 in the revision lecture. In Module 6, we have already done a revision lecture. We have covered the centrifugal compressor. If you want to watch this video, you will follow this lecture. You will follow this lecture. You will follow this lecture. Because in this lecture, we will cover the axial flow compressors. In the axial flow compressor and centrifugal compressor, there are a few things common. So, if you want to follow this video, you will be able to watch this lecture. Okay, so now we will discuss the axial flow compressors. And that is related to the university problems that we have to work out. Okay, so if you are new to my channel, consider subscribing and click the bell icon for getting further updates and don't forget to share it with your friends so that they can also learn online. And also check out my telegram channel and group so that you won't miss any updates from me. So first of all, we are going to discuss how to draw the velocity triangle in the case of axial flow compressor. So we have discussed this velocity triangle and compared to the axial flow compressor and the velocity triangle. There is a major difference. That's why we have discussed this in the triangle. Angles measure either another from tangential direction. Either another E line and another number a perum angles measure either another. But in the case of axial flow compressor, number a perum angles measure a vertical line or turn another. This is known as the axial direction. Number a perum angles measure in the about axial direction or turn another. Another major difference. Okay. And apart from that, if it is another moon carrying a good in or three can attend it. And first one is. Uh, peripheral velocity will be equal at inlet and outlet. That means u1 is equal to u2 is equal to u. And also the velocity of flow at inlet and outlet is also equal. That means we can take vf1 is equal to vf2 is equal to vf. Okay. Now uh, let's see. Yani just construction on the Pareto. Construction chain the number is the moon and velocity triangles are plotted in the other pole. Then in a inlet triangle, outlet triangle, or a ball in a look in the because uh, u1 u2 same I don't know. Okay. So we will study the number of the plot in the v1 on a okay. That is the absolute velocity and number if you want to plot you up on the triangle close either in a VR one good to VR one of the tangents like to go room even an era portal on the VR to a game even a number you to plot to do you to plot to the triangle close either number in the number can get a V to get to same procedure on a triangle constructing the other ball in the number velocity of volume other will flow you mark in the V1 in the horizontal component on a VW one and other the vertical component on a VF one other ball a V2 in the horizontal component on a and what a VW to mark it in there and other in the vertical component VF2 मार्कीतरेंटे and angles नमले वडे same terminology से नेने use इन्दे V1 vertical वाईट मेकिंग नमले साधारण ना तो horizontal वाईट मेकिंग ना angle नंट कर लो शे वडे शदिका नमले axial direction वाईट ना angle डिक्कन दे okay पे ये angle आणे नमले alpha डिक्कन दे आधे बोले relative velocity मेकिंग ना angle तीस डिक्कन दे आधे बोले वडे नमले absolute velocity मेकिंग ना angle बीस डिक्कन दे relative velocity मेकिंग ना angle five डिक्कन दे same terminology से आणे याने वडे Alpha and beta are absolute velocities making the angle and the theta and phi are the relative velocities vertical weight making the angles. Okay, that's all about velocity triangle. Okay, and one more thing, due to symmetry of the triangles, we have discussed this in one triangle, we have discussed this in one triangle. Okay, now due to symmetry of the triangles, we can say that alpha is equal to phi. Okay, that's why inlet to alpha angle will be equal to outlet to phi angle. Okay, and also theta will be is equal to beta. Okay, this angle theta will be equal to beta as well. Now, this point is going to be extra note. Okay, now we will see the work input in the equation. The work input in the equation is going to be two ways to express the centrifugal compressor. Two ways means one is from Euler's equation and second one is based on the thermodynamic principles. Okay, that's why MCP delta T in the equation we will represent the work input in the equation. Now, Euler's equation is going to be per stage. पर स्टेज ले नमक के इंडाउन ना वर्क इनपुट इंदा वर्णन दंड आने m into v w two minus v w one into u बट एक्चुअली u one u two कॉमन आये दोंडे सेम आये दोंडे नमला द पोर्टे कर दूँ नोलो ओके नाउ टोटल वर्क इनपुट इफ वी हैव नंबर n नंबर ऑफ स्टेजेस n नंबर ऑफ स्टेजेस इंदा दंड निकल नमक का दने n उन्नटे मल्टीप्लाई आ ओके 
Now we can express the same equation in terms of angles also. Okay, that is why VWT and VW1 we can angles in the terms of replace the angles. So from the inlet triangle we can actually write tan alpha is equal to opposite side is VW1 divided by adjacent side is VF1 that is VF. So VF1 is same as and VF is not equal to Okay, so from this you can actually write VW1 is equal to VF into tan alpha. Okay, but tan alpha into VF common I don't know what they could have done it okay and from the outlet velocity triangle see tan beta is equal to uh, VW2 divided by VF negative okay so VW2 is equal to tan beta into VF up even in VF and then a common on it but VW2 in the program I'm okay VF tan beta you are able to VW1 in the program VF tan alpha in good to happen I'm gonna VF within the port they could do okay so our equation reduces to mu VF into tan beta minus tan alpha the, the per per stage in on it number of stages into the angle we have to multiply it with n so that we will get the total work input required and here we have to remember one more equation and that is degree of reaction but degree of reaction equation over time r is equal to vf divided by 2u into tan theta plus tan phi on but usually make a problem to them are in the value number the thunder and down and that will be 50 percentage Okay, any other than the till and the glue cello problem to the number of the 50 percentage I to assume to you on the so 50 percentage means are in the value in the recum that can be taken as 1 by 2 upon the law 1 by 2 what a substitute then you know 2 2 gets cancelled and what you'll get is u is equal to vf into tan theta plus tan phi p relationship with amaku u are in any other vf for gana and legal vf are in any other u can and i'm okay utilize the amateur okay and if it is a second a guardian if it is an angle now we can work in put in the equation per kilogram will represent the am are they will a per stage will represent the am okay but total work can put the garden and the daddy equation and angle number of stage you are to multiply that the petrim carrying on the note down gm and if it is normally run the carrying along with him or three can that I turned the first one is flow coefficient so flow coefficient is defined as the ratio between velocity of flow to the peripheral velocity that is phi f is equal to vf divided by u okay but then I'm going to go on a little equation represent the other than if the degree of reaction is equal to 50 percentage but are the number one by two no good kind of the kill here you can find the term vf by you but vf by you know what another phi f Pidil nana nama ke phi f separate itu dekat awal nana. Pas separate itu ni, what will get is one by tan theta plus tan phi nanti tu. Pidil nangal separate by half t anda karya nula, nama ke problem tu le. Apo derive itu dekat alamadi. Apo orang teri kya vf by u adawa flow coefficient de nama ke evidenya available ari kyu. Degree of reaction equation ni available ari kyu nana orang teri kya. Okay. Now second point work factor ana. Ida nama le already centrifugal compressor in the case we will discuss the work factor we will discuss the pressure coefficient and discuss the pressure coefficient now we will discuss the work factor so what is the work factor? actual work input to the impeller work input so the same definition we will use the same definition now the denominator is changing the impeller work input equation is changing that is the denominator changing now the pressure coefficient in the case the denominator is changing okay so what you'll get the work factor is equal to cp into t2 minus t1 this is the actual work input in terms of uh, static properties and uh, the impeller work input to namak area u into vw2 minus vw1 into n apple sadhika namal about the denominator look at the total work input on the other stage in a level like look at the okay apple we denominator on the angle number of stage you item multiply them can I'm axial flow compressor the makeup make a warm number of stages in the over a single stage I to axial flow compressor in the other thing okay park are you know not either okay an actual work input in the equation say I'm already centrifugal compressor in the case will discuss either than a same equations on a even in a mock you see on the day other MCP Delta T and a basic equation the word of the problem of the stagnation properties in a terminal are they well a static properties in a terminal number could express the other than even a thing like a card in study can your last lecture lip are I am with the boy done a e equation a e last the equation other way and equations in a mock you see I'm with another we can only use these equations if the compression process is isentropic isentropic Allah angle number e equations you see I'm at the lab okay I'll link in the really standard equations and the UCM isentropic on angle math and I'm okay a last day there and equations you see I'm better to know because number what I replace in the t0 2 divided by t0 1 in a p0 2 in the p0 1 in terms will replace the energy in the day okay other chain on the angle that process should be isentropic 
ഓക്കെ ഇപ്പോൾ ഈ ഇക്വേഷൻ നിങ്ങൾ ഐസൻട്രോപ്പിക് ആണെങ്കിൽ മാത്രം യൂസ് ചെയ്താൽ മതി അല്ലാത്ത കേസിൽ നമ്മൾ ഈ ഇക്വേഷൻ തന്നെയാണ് യൂസ് ചെയ്യേണ്ടത് ഓക്കെ സിമിലർലി ഐസൻട്രോപ്പിക് എഫിഷ്യൻസിയുടെ കൺസെപ്റ്റ് ഒക്കെ നമ്മൾ സെൻട്രി ഫ്യൂഗൽ കമ്പ്രസറിൽ ഡിസ്കസ് ചെയ്ത അതേപോലെ തന്നെയാണ് ഞാനത് വീണ്ടും ഇനി എക്സ്പ്ലെയിൻ ചെയ്യുന്നില്ല ഇവിടെ ഐസൻട്രോപ്പിക് എഫിഷ്യൻസി നമുക്ക് സ്റ്റാഗ്നേഷൻ പ്രോപ്പർട്ടീസിൻ്റെ ടേമിലും അതേപോലെ സ്റ്റാറ്റിക് പ്രോപ്പർട്ടീസിൻ്റെ ടേമിലും എക്സ്പ്ലെയിൻ ചെയ്യാവുന്നതാണ് അതേപോലെ ഈ ഇക്വേഷൻസ് ഒക്കെ നിങ്ങൾക്ക് അറിയാമെന്ന് വിചാരിക്കുന്നു See, next we are going to discuss a university problem based on this. So, look at the problem description. An axial flow compressor draws in air at 20 degrees Celsius and delivers it at 50 degrees Celsius. Assuming 50 percentage degree of reaction, calculate the velocity of flow and the number of stages. If blade velocity is 100 meter per second and work factor as 0.85, assume the blades are symmetrical and air inlet and exit angles as alpha is equal to 10 degree and beta is equal to 40 degree so i hope all of you have read the question very carefully so njan ivada thannittulla details ellam onnu eduthu ezhudirundu so we have given the temperatures at inlet and outlet and we are also given the degree of reaction blade velocity is also given work factor is given and the air angles is also given appo ningal shadhiga air angles ennu parnaynal in the case of axial flow compressor it is nothing but the angle made with the absolute velocity at inlet and outlet that means air angles nu parrenjale alpha yum beta yana so it is given as 10 degree and 40 degree respectively okay and here we have asked to find two things the first one is velocity of flow and second one is the number of stages okay so how to find velocity of flow so adinu vendiittu namukku ivada degree of reaction thannirundu so namukku ariyam degree of reaction the equation le velocity of flow inde term varunnundu we know the equation of degree of reaction as vf divided by 2u into tan theta plus tan phi so in this equation we know the value of r and we know u and theta and phi we can find because theta is nothing but beta if you are considering symmetry okay and phi is nothing but alpha okay appi ee two angles um namukku ariyam so ella values um namukku ariyam only unknown in this equation is vf so from this equation you can actually determine vf and that will fetch you 98.62 meter per second okay so once you got the value of vf from the velocity triangle you can actually determine vw2 and vw1 okay yana adu onnu kodi explain cheyam already yan velocity triangle varachadana so tan alpha is equal to from the inlet velocity triangle we can actually write tan alpha is equal to opposite side divided by adjacent side that is vw1 divided by vf so from this vw1 is equal to tan alpha into vf okay adey pole outlet velocity triangle nu namukku endu eludam tan beta is equal to vw2 divided by vf2 nu eludam that means vf okay so from this we can actually evaluate vw2 is equal to tan beta into vf okay appo njan ivada vw2 um vw1 um rendum evaluate cheyidu vechittunde the first vw2 is 82.75 meter per second and vw1 is 17.389 So once you have got the value of VW1 and VW2 you can substitute the same in the equation of work factor so work factor in the case of uh, centrifugal compressor and axial flow compressor is it is a ratio between actual work input to the impeller work input but axial flow compressor in the case illa you have to take care of it because here we have number of stages in the numerator we have to MCP delta T representing that will be representing the total work input ഓക്കെ അപ്പോൾ നമ്മൾ ഡിനോമിനേറ്ററിൽ എഴുതുന്നത് എന്തായിരിക്കണം ടോട്ടൽ വർക്ക് ഇൻപുട്ട് ആയിരിക്കണം കാരണം ഇവിടെ നമുക്ക് ഇൻലെറ്റ് ടെമ്പറേച്ചേഴ്സ് ആൻഡ് ഔട്ട്ലെറ്റ് ടെമ്പറേച്ചർ തന്നിട്ടുള്ളത് കൺസിഡറിങ് ഓൾ ദി സ്റ്റേജസ് ടുഗദർ ഓക്കെ അപ്പോൾ നമ്മൾ ഡിനോമിനേറ്ററിൽ വർക്ക് ഇൻപുട്ട് എഴുതുമ്പോഴും കൺസിഡറിങ് ഓൾ ദി സ്റ്റേജസ് ടുഗദർ ആയിരിക്കണം ദാറ്റ് മീൻസ് ഇമ്പലർ വർക്ക് ഇൻപുട്ട് പെർ സ്റ്റേജ് ഇൻ ടു നമ്പർ ഓഫ് സ്റ്റേജസ് കൊണ്ട് മൾട്ടിപ്ലൈ ചെയ്തിട്ടുണ്ടായിരിക്കണം അപ്പോൾ നിങ്ങൾ ഈ ഇക്വേഷൻ ഒബ്സേർവ് ചെയ്ത് കഴിഞ്ഞാൽ ഇവിടെ നമുക്ക് ഫൈവ് ഡബ്ല്യൂവിൻ്റെ വാല്യൂ അറിയാം ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് പോയിൻറ്റ് എയ്റ്റ് ഫൈവ് സി പി നമുക്ക് അറിഞ്ഞിരിക്കണം ചിലപ്പോൾ പ്രോബ്ലത്തിൽ തന്നിട്ടുണ്ടാവാം ടി വൺ ടി ടു അറിയാം യു അറിയാം വി ഡബ്ല്യു ടു ആൻഡ് വി ഡബ്ല്യു വൺ നമ്മൾ ഇപ്പോൾ ഇവാലുവേറ്റ് ചെയ്തു ഓൺലി അൺനോൺ എന്ന് പറയുന്നത് ആരാണ് ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് ദി നമ്പർ ഓഫ് സ്റ്റേജസ് okay so if you substitute the value of vw2 and vw1 here you can actually get the value of number of stages as 5.43 nu kittum so since we have got a decimal value here ningal idu round up cheyanam we have to take the next highest value that is 6 so the number of stages is equal to 6 nanu nammal final answer valare simple aayittulla oru question aanu ee rendu equation aanu namukku major aayittu axial flow compressor in the case il eppolum utilize cheyanda aayittullathu സി നെക്സ്റ്റ് നമ്മൾ ഡിസ്കസ് ചെയ്യാൻ പോകുന്നത് ടെക്സ്റ്റ് ബുക്കിൽ നിന്നുള്ളൊരു വർക്ക് ഔട്ട് എക്സാമ്പിൾ ആണ് സോ ലുക്ക് അറ്റ് ദി പ്രോബ്ലം ഡിസ്ക്രിപ്ഷൻ ആൻഡ് ആക്സിയൽ ഫ്ലോ കമ്പ്രസർ ഹാവിങ് എയ്റ്റ് സ്റ്റേജസ് ആൻഡ് വിത്ത് ഫിഫ്റ്റി പെർസെൻറ്റേജ് ഡിഗ്രി ഓഫ
it compresses air with a pressure ratio of 4 the inlet conditions of air are 20 degrees celsius and 1 bar the air flows through the compressor with a constant velocity of 90 meter per second the mean speed of the rotor blade is 180 meter per second isentropic efficiency of the compressor is 82 percentage calculate work done by the machine per kilogram of air and second question is blade angles so i hope all of you have read the question very carefully so njan ivada thannittulla details ella onu eduthu ezhudirund so we have given the number of stages as 8 and degree of reaction as 0.5 and the total pressure ratio is given as 4 and the inlet temperature and pressure is also given velocity of flow is given and blade velocity is given as 180 meter per second and isentropic efficiency is 0.82 and what we have to find here we have to determine the work done by the machine per kilogram of air and we have to also determine the blade angles that means we have to find the value of theta and phi so how to find the value of theta and phi see we already discussed the degree of reaction equation we have theta and phi here okay so if we have degree of reaction the value of the velocity of flow or u or m so we can actually formulate an equation in terms of theta and phi okay but theta and phi unknown aayittulla or equation namukku vidudu kittum okay appo ini theta yum phi yum unknown aayittulla vera equation kudi kitti kaynale namukku adu solve ed edukkavunnadanu alle appo namukku theta yilum phi yilulla vera equation illa pagaram namukku beta yilum alpha yilulla or equation ivadund that is nothing but the impeller work input impeller work input in equation le nammal vw2 num vw1 num in terms of tan alpha and tan beta namukku replace cheyavunnadanu so we'll get this equation okay appo ee equation de lhs ariyamengil namukku beta neem alpha neem endu cheyan pattum in terms of phi and theta namukku replace cheyan pattum okay because of symmetry of the triangles okay appo alpha is equal to phi num beta is equal to theta num namukku replace cheyan pattum so we'll get another equation in theta and phi but we solve it, we will have to solve it. That is work input. Okay, so how do we do that? Work input is one of our formulae. That is assume work factor is equal to 1. Assume. Okay, so work factor 1 is one of our We can actually write the actual work input is equal to the impeller work input. Okay, so actual work input is equal to the value. That is how I say it. Okay, impeller work input in the impeller work input, we have unit value, VF, only unknown is tan beta and alpha. Okay, we have tan beta and tan alpha in terms of theta and phi replace here. Okay, so what we have to do is the first step is the actual work input. Okay, so what we have to do is the actual work input, you have to find this temperature difference. That is the final temperature minus initial temperature. That is the one that we have to do is the isentropic efficiency. So we know the equation of isentropic efficiency that is T2 dash minus T1 divided by T2 minus T1 and we have to write the stage in the end that is symbolically T8 dash minus T1 divided by T8 minus T1 and we have to do it. From this we can actually find the value of T8 minus T1 that is temperature difference we have to do it. Because we have to do the isentropic efficiency value T1. This is the only unknown. T8 dash आना ये T8 dash है ना हम के उड़ना किट्टा because इधर एक isentropic process है ना process one to eight dash ना हम को isentropic process आईटे कंसर रहिया so we can actually write this ratio between pressure and temperatures that is T8 dash divided by T1 is equal to P8 divided by P1 whole power gamma minus one divided by gamma इधर ना हम लोग centrifugal compression ना कैसे लोग के यू सी आधे relationship आने इवर ना उनके doubt ना down चल पो इवर इन दोनों P8 dash नहीं यू सी नहीं ला because P8 dash will be equal to P8 okay because they are the points on the same isobaric line okay so इवर ना हम लोग P8 इंडी आधे ये बोले P8 by P1 P8 by P1 ना हम लोग इवर तंदर इंडा ratio direct तंदर इंडे okay so, gamma value नमक आरिया, T1 आरिया, only unknown इन्दो बरन दा आरिया ने T8 dash आर। Okay, तो from this we can actually evaluate T8 dash। Okay, पर यानी इतना नयरम पारण जेदो reverse procedure आने। Okay, एप्परू निंगले reverse procedure लो निंगले thinking दे नियाले निंगले problem से पट्टा ना solve या मिट्टू। इन्हीं यान निंगले मानसिल आवान डेटो forward procedure जस्ट उन्दो पारिया। First, we start with T8 dash and we start with T8 dash and we start with all the values. 
ओके टी एट डाश क्या वालू निवे सब्सटूटी कम टेमपेच डिफरें अथवा टी ए माइनस टी वण कटे टी ए माइनस टी वण कब्सटूटी कम गेट दि वालू ऑफ आक्वल वर्क इनपुट आक्वल वर्क इनपुट क्रम हियर यु कैन फोर्मुलेट एन इक्वेशन फोर टैन बीट माइनस टैन आलफा सीक्वल टू वन पॉइंट थ्री फोर सिक्स ओके इवे नमु बीट आलफन इन टेम्स ऑफ तीट आई रिप्ले अब नाम इक्वेशन आक्चल टैन तीट माइनस टैन फाइव सीक्वल टू वन पॉइंट थ्री फोर सिक्स मार सो लेट इट बी हियर दिस इज इक्वेशन नंबर वन इन नमुक तीट फाइव रामावेशन एवं क्या फ्रम डिग्री ऑफ रियाक्ष इक्वेशन अब ई इक्वेशन री अरेज वाट गेट टैन तीट प्लस टैन फाइव कम नमुक वि एफ यूनि आर ए वालूस अम दाट ईक्वल टू टू कम सो दाट ईवर इक्वेशन नंबर टू सो वि हाव गोट टू इक्वेशन इन Uh, theta and phi. So you can solve for theta and phi, and you'll finally get the value of theta and phi as 59.13 and 18.1 degree respectively. If you are going to do a little bit of a study, if you are going to do actual work input, impeller work input, consider it. That is per unit mass. And that is why we are going to do impeller work input. We are going to multiply the number of stages. If you are going to do it into eight, that is why we are going to do a little bit of a study. We are going to discuss the previous problem. That is why we are going to do it. वाले सीमपिटल क्वस्न इतने क्वस्नसों एक्सामि एक्सपेक्टा या तकाल लक्चर वैंडपी है सो टेक्स्ट बुक सीमिल कुरे प्रॉब्लमसु अद प्राक्टीस ओके